In Europe, autumn is taking a long time to arrive. The beaches are still busy, the centre of cities still swelteringly hot. And now there's data from the EU's Climate Change Service to prove we're seeing record-breaking temperatures. September was the hottest yet, by 0.5 degrees centigrade. January to September this year were 1.4 degrees above the pre-industrial average. That's just below the 1.5 degree increase world leaders have been urged to target as the absolute ceiling. July and August were the hottest recorded, which means 2023 is well on the way to being the hottest year ever. Scientists say the cause is the continued burning of fossil fuels combined with the El Nino weather effect. Whether this is a new normal or not is something we cannot answer, because what the new normal is, we will only find out once we've stopped burning fossil fuels. As long as we continue to burn fossil fuels, these events will become more and more frequent. The effects have been clear to see. Widening droughts and unprecedented wildfires across the globe, matched by extraordinary downpours, leading to catastrophic floods in regions not used to them. The human cost has risen. Our climate is imploding faster than we can cope with extreme weather events hitting every corner of the planet. This year's temperature spike may have other contributory factors. The 11-year sun cycle, lower than normal sulphur emissions from industry and shipping, and a volcanic eruption in Tonga, which released huge amounts of heat-trapping water vapour. But the underlying causes are the ones we already know about, and the ones only mankind can fix. Thursday's data is another reminder that the time needed for that fix is running out. Simon McGregorwood. TRT World.